Alrighty, hello guys, welcome to Faces back to another Stormworks build and rescue video. Today, I'm actually thinking of swapping these ailerons around. They need to be fixed a little bit. I also kind of feel like making this tail thin, fin thing a little bit bigger, a little bit taller, a little bit more, a little bit more, I don't know, something there, because at the moment that does nothing really. Um, I want to go ahead and maybe add a propeller to the back of the engine, because that would be kind of cool, and we can actually force ourselves into the sky that way. That would be pretty nice. Um, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, let's get on with it, shall we? Alright, okay, so let's go ahead and grab this. We obviously need to take it to the workbench to do things. We're gonna go ahead and move this sideways just a little bit until it hits, I don't know, maybe the center or close. Uh, and that'd be pretty good. We then need to figure out a few things. So, I'm thinking we actually start off by changing these. Uh, essentially, they just need to be swapped around. So, let's delete this one. And we've obviously deleted the other one as well. Control surface. We're going to grab the medium ones. We're obviously going to grab this. And I want to put it on like this. There we go. Very good. We're going to then take it to this side and do the same thing. There we go. Uh, and that is... Uh, not right. That is not right. No, 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 no. It actually goes like this, right? I'm pretty sure that's okay. Alright, cool. So, we need to make sure that those are actually connected to things. There we go. Connect it to there and there. We need to do the same thing on this side. Connect it to there and there. And then we need to do this all the way down to here. Yep. Alright, cool. Uh, same there as well. And that's awesome. That should work fine. Great. Alright, so the other thing we need to do then, is we need to make sure that this is a little bit taller and stuff. So we're going to delete all of these, we're going to delete that, we're actually going to delete this, and we're going to make it slightly taller. In fact, delete all of these, delete that as well. Can we have a medium? Can we have a medium? Control surface, please. Oh my, okay, that might be a bit big. It might be a little bit too big. I don't know, we'll see. Anyway, drag this up and over the top, like this. Delete that piece. We're going to have a wedge. A wedge, one of these. Go on the back of there, if we can, like that. We're then going to have the same thing on the front. Okay, like this. And we're going to have it come down the front and be awesome and stuff. That's how I want it to be anyway. I want it to be awesome and stuff. All right, cool. Maybe we actually make it a little bit longer. Yeah, put another one of these on. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, cool. Attach that to there. We then want to do stuff like this. Bend this downwards a little bit. All right, pretty good. Fill that in, obviously. Fill this in as well. And then I'm thinking we go with... We actually go with these pieces. There we go. Yeah, that's pretty awesome, actually. Go ahead and fill those in. All right, and then we need it to go start going forwards. So if we just put this on here, make it go forwards like this. Yep, go ahead and put this piece on here, like so. I think that actually probably makes it look a little bit better. It also makes it so that it might actually do stuff now, which is great. So, there you go, left and right, pretty good. Let's go ahead and attach this to here. Attach it to there, and also attach it to the batteries as well. There we go, alright, very good. So now we've made that bigger, we've made the ailerons actually want to work now. Um... Good, pretty good. Alright, so the only other thing that I can actually think of doing straight away, which we can actually do straight away, is go on both sides, obviously, delete this piece, grab a pipe. Yep, we're gonna have the T-pipe put in like this. Alright, okay, we're gonna angle it downwards. Alright, we're gonna angle it sideways, we're gonna angle it backwards. And essentially, we need another gearbox. So, gearbox is gonna go right here. We're gonna have it point towards the engine. Like that, that's actually going to connect. That's awesome. We're then going to have it come straight back from there. So we need a pipe. And we're going to have it come straight backwards. Uh, and we're going to have it come out the butt. So like here, I think. Yeah, this might end up looking pretty good. At the same time, it obviously might not. So, I mean, we've always always got that issue in our head. It might look good. It might not look good. All right, put that there. Pretty epic indeed. Drag this out the back end. Go ahead and put one of these in. And maybe, just maybe, grab a propeller and put it on the back. There we go. Way. Oh, this is going to be interesting. If this works, this is going to be great. So, essentially, we need these to be the same. 
That gearbox right there is 2 to 1. So this is also going to be 2 to 1. There we go. Uh, same on this side. This is also going to be 2 to 1. There we go. Uh, they obviously need power, so give them power. There we go. Go ahead and give this one power as well. And that should be awesome. These things should spin. And that's great. So, neutral. Alright. Neutral. Okay, very good. We're going to go ahead and actually make this have 5. Same with this one. They can have five on each. Because I think that would be pretty cool. Five on this one as well. And five on this one. Then we need like a, a minus one. So we actually need a number. And it needs to be minus one. So grab this. Put it in again. Alright. Make it minus one. There we go. Minus one. Connect that up to both of those propellers. There we go. And there we go. Uh, and there we go. Spawn it in. See what happens. Oh, yeah, dude, twin propellers actually looks really cool. Nice. Oh, this could end up being really, really nice. All right, jump up here, go inside, go ahead and go upstairs. All right, grab this, press this, do this. Oh, yeah. Look at us go, dude. We're just, like, grinding. Um, right, okay, so I get it. We're going to have a little bit of a problem. We're going to have a big problem, actually. We have nowhere near enough oomph to actually get us into the sky. Let's see, obviously, if the wind can do it for us. Alright, so the wind can actually do it for us. We're not that strong, though. We're still not... I don't know. It's not that powerful to get it into the sky. So we need a little bit more. We need a little bit more power. I might have to mess with the gear ratios. I'm not sure. But we're flying uh, on two engines with four propellers. That's super cool. That's really cool. All right, I'm going to turn the wind off. Make sure we can actually stay in the sky. Okay, I don't think we can. <laughs> I think the wind is actually a big part of us staying in the sky. Okay, right. We need to, we need to fix that. We really need to fix that. Okay, how do we actually fix this, though? Like, I mean, changing the gear ratios downwards a little bit. Let's go to 3 to 2. Let's go to 3 to 2 on this one as well. And the same thing on these ones. So we're going to go 3 to 2. We're going to go 3 to 2. I think that'll be good. I think that'll be good for us, which is awesome. Uh, we obviously need to put in some sort of system to catapult us into the sky as well. Uh, and realistically, too, we need to get rid of some of the weight. So essentially, if I delete all of this, right? If I delete all of that, and I delete all of this as well. Then we get some wing pieces. Yeah, like these ones. We can actually put a bunch of these in. We can actually put loads of these in. And realistically... Oh, I can't fit those ones. Ah, put that in. Okay. Delete this. We can obviously put another one in. Nice. Am I doing this on both sides? Yes, I am. Right, okay. So, this is obviously going to go here. And we're going to have another one on this side. Right here. And then these are going to have to go together somehow, like this. And then we're going to have to sort these out. There we go, very good. Delete this row. Put this in. Realistically, we can actually have, like, a massive thing go up here. There we go. And we can just have loads of these. So, essentially, these just weigh less per block than the blocks themselves do. So, putting wings in like this is such a good idea. Alright, cool. With the bits that we can't actually do, we're just going to fill in. And that's going to be fine. All right, awesome. We need to do the other side too, though. So delete, like, all of this up to the tippity top. And fill them in with these. Here we go. One. Two. Three. Four. All right, very good. Bring this down, down to there. And I think we're good. Nice. Dude, I like this. I like this a lot. Alright, pretty good. So, let's go ahead and spawn it in again. Let's make sure that we can actually fly. Uh, if we can't fly, we might have to add more engines or, or stuff like that. The wings are having issues now. Why is it having an issue? Is the other one having an issue too? I don't think so. It just spawned in weirdly, maybe? Let's try that again. No, alright, cool. We got a broken wing. We got a broken wing. What is wrong with it, though? What's wrong with the wing, dude? There should be nothing wrong with the wings. There should be nothing wrong with the wings at all. 
Delete that maybe and just try it with just this. Try again. Come on. Oh, just work, please. Why is it doing this? It should just be fine. It should, realistically, it should just be fine. Oh, this is upsetting spaghetti. If this is going to continue to do this, anyway. Get inside. Let's see if we can just bash it out. Here we go. There we go. I think it fixed itself. I think it did fix itself. Alright, so we are now moving. We're getting tipped over. We're actually upside down. Alright, okay. We got issues. We got big issues. This thing just gets, like, thrown around all over the place. Watch this. I'll spawn it in with the wind. Look at it. It just gets... It gets thrown around everywhere. Which is crazy. Look at it. It's just... It's just getting pulled away from us. How do I fix that? I have no idea how to fix that. That's annoying. That's really annoying. Alright, okay. We're just jumping in again. Why not? Here we go. We're gonna throttle up. And we're just gonna go for it. Here we go. Ready? We are in the sky. And we are flying. Okay, very good. But, are we only flying because there's wind? Let's have a little checky here. Turn the wind off. And... Please keep flying. I can't tell if we're going down or not. No, I think we're good now. I think we can actually fly now. It's not very powerful, but I think it works. Yeah, it totally works. Alright, that's great. That is actually fantastic. Dude, it looks quite cool too. The double propellers are really, really cool. I like it. Okay, so we still can't actually take off like we want to, but uh, we can actually take off if we use the waves, which is great. Uh, so essentially, we need to add some sort of uh, system to our plane that allows us to... One... Actually, you know what? If we have... If we have propellers that we can angle down in terms of water propellers to actually push us into the sky, that might be a good idea. So we'll have them on pivots. Uh, somewhere at the front underneath and we'll be able to just catapult ourselves upwards. That would be great actually. That'd be very very nice. So maybe we can do that. Anyway, let's try a landing. This isn't something we've actually done yet. So trying a landing might be dangerous. We'll see. Uh, we're just gonna go down. The water is actually completely fine. So that's good. Um, yeah, keep going down. Here we go. Here we go indeedy. Yeah, we should be able to land this thing easy. Realistically, here we go. So we're going to keep going forwards. There we go. We're going to lower our throttle a little bit. I'm going to drag our collective back. And we're going to land. Just like... Just like this. Alright, we're slowly going to go down. Here we go. Very nice. Come on, please go down. What are you doing? Alright, we're gonna land like this then. There we go, we landed. So this thing is actually very easy to actually like land and fly and stuff. Uh, we need to fix these two together because there's a problem there. But um, yeah, you know what? It actually works. It totally works. Got our propeller on the front. Got our propeller on the back. Uh, we got an entrance. We've got some beds down here. We need like a toilet or something in here. Uh, I'm gonna move these downwards slightly so we can use them. Uh, there was a box out there. That's kind of cool. We need some more equipment back here on the walls. And we need to figure out what to do with the rest of it. Because at the moment, nothing. Uh, we need some seats, actually. Some seats would be very nice. Anyway, uh, I think I'm going to end this video here. We didn't really do too much. But um, we fixed a few things. Uh, we made it look a little bit prettier. And now it actually kind of works. It sits in the water completely fine. Uh, we got the propeller on the back. We got the propeller on the front. And... Yeah, it actually works, which is crazy. Anyway, uh, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. If you guys have any ideas on what else we can add to this thing, uh, let me know in the comments down below. We obviously need an instrument panel and stuff like that, so we'll probably end up doing that. And, um, yeah, I guess we'll see what happens in the next one. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you in the next one. Goodbye.